Today is July 21st, 2023. This is Singlostic, host of the updates, bringing you your daily Wuthering Waves update. From the official um, Wuthering Waves Billy Billy account, this is their booth happening starting from today at Billy Billy World. This will happen for like three days, but I'll show you the booth real quick. I'm hoping there's I'm hoping there's merch to be sold here. Here's a little hidey hole for you to play the game. You can see here there's a little like collaboration with RTX. You'll see that a bit later. And you can see here there's a presentation stage. And you can see over here from the in the bottom corner they have like different events at different times. And you can note here there's a computer here on the left and a computer here on the right. What I think these are for is... You can see here from this photo, guy playing on the left here, assuming there's a guy playing on the right as well. Both of their gameplay footages are being projected to the screen, and what I'm thinking is happening here is, it's one of those boss speed runs that you see on the Wuthering Waves developer Twitter account. It's... It, it, it's cool. You know? Just a bit overdone. Don't care much for that. Here's the cosplayers. One thing to note here is that Yang Yang's outfit got changed a little bit again. You can see here, even in the official art, her bandages are black now. But we haven't seen anything that's like Chisya levels of changes yet. But anyways, either ways, cosplayers are cool. They bring life to the event, as usual. And then, do, 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 what else do we have? Oh yeah, and the Kuro game collaborated with Nvidia to incorporate DLSS in their game. Uh, if you don't have an RTX, you don't care about this. Um, th you can, if you have an RTX 30 or a 40, you will probably appreciate this. This helps with performance, I think. I don't have it, so I don't. Re I never really cared. Maybe in the future. Wink, wink. Also. Pretty unlucky that for the first day, the event got flooded. Oh, the Azure Lane booth got hit the worst, but hopefully they'll recover. Hopefully everyone recovers, and that's people being goofy. I'm not very optimistic that we will get any special news for the game's future in this event. I would love to be proven wrong, but maybe they're saving this kind of stuff for Tokyo Game Show in September. Again, love to be proven wrong. But that has been your Wuthering Waves update.